All right, let's say you find yourself in a position where you have an object that has the incorrect orientation and you've accidentally gone ahead and applied your transformations. So there's no way of undoing this by just clearing transformations. So how do we go about aligning your object to the correct orientation? So in order to do this, the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to create, say, a plane. And let's just go ahead and duplicate this plane. Now, what I'm gonna do is take this plane and snap it to one of the faces here. So I'm gonna just guess which is the bottom of this. Now, since this is a symmetrical model and it pretty much looks exact on six faces, it's gonna be hard, but let's just go ahead and assume that this area here is the bottom, right? So let's just assume this is the bottom. And what I'm gonna do is just go to snap and and then under that I'm going to say face project and I'm going to check align rotation to target. Now I'm not going to turn snap on, I'm going to keep it off. So I'll just grab this face and I'm going to hit G on the keyboard and then control. So let me just get closer to this. So I'm going to try and get it to snap to the face here. So I'll just scale this down a little bit more. And we want to snap this to the flattest part of the mesh. So just go ahead and do that. So now it's gone ahead and snapped there. I'll just increase the size a little bit. I'll select the object that we have here and the plane that we created. And I'm going to parent this. So I'm going to set a parent. And then the next thing I'm going to do is just grab this plane that we have here and snap it to this face that we have here. So just go ahead and do that. And now we'll just rotate this by 180 degrees so that we have it on the top. And so now we've made it sit on a perfectly flat surface. So the next thing we're going to do is just duplicate this plane. And I'm going to rotate this Y axis by 90 degrees. And we're going to snap this face to that. So again, I'm going to repeat the process. Just create a duplicate, scale this down like so, and G and Control in order to snap it to the face. So I'll just decrease it in size so that it's easier to snap this. So you want to snap to the flattest part. Scale it up again. So I don't think it's sitting perfectly flat there. So I'm just going to try that again. Now that I'm sure it's sitting flat, I will go ahead and click on this and this and set another parent. And then just grab the plane, hold down G and then snap it to this. So once I've gone ahead and done all this, Going to go ahead and apply the transformations. So just go ahead and now purge these. So apply all my transformations. So now I can set my origin to geometry and I can just send this to the 3D cursor. Now we can just orient this correctly. So this needs to be spun around the y-axis by 180 degrees. So now we've gone ahead and achieved the correct orientation. 